Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. Modern combat drones are unmanned aerial vehicles used in military operations. They vary in size and purpose, featuring advanced sensors, stealth capabilities, and autonomous functions. These drones provide intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, and precision strike capabilities. They play a crucial role in enhancing military effectiveness and minimizing risk to human personnel. Today, we will show you the 10 best combat drones. MQ-9 Reaper The MQ-9 Reaper is the primary offensive strike unmanned aerial vehicle for the U.S. Air Force. Given its significant loiter time, wide-range sensors, multi-mode communication suite, and precision weapons, it provides a unique capability to perform strike, coordination, and reconnaissance against high-value, fleeting, and time-sensitive targets. The Reaper is part of a remotely piloted aircraft system. A fully operational system consists of several sensor weapon equipped aircraft, ground control station, predator primary satellite link, and spare equipment along with operations and maintenance crews for deployed 24-hour missions. The Reaper incorporates a laser rangefinder designator, which precisely designates targets for employment of laser guided munitions, such as the guided bomb Unit 12 Paveway 2. The drone is also equipped with a synthetic aperture radar to enable GBU-38 Joint Direct Attack Munitions targeting. The MQ-9 can also employ four laser-guided missiles, air-to-ground missile 114 Hellfire, which possesses highly accurate, low-collateral damage, anti-armor and anti-personnel engagement capabilities. The drone can operate continuously for 27 hours at an altitude of up to 50,000 feet or 15,240 meters and at speeds of approximately 276 miles per hour or 444 kilometers per hour. Luna NG The Luna NG is the new unmanned aerial system developed by Rheinmetall for the armed forces of Germany and Ukraine. The drone plays a pivotal role in the network command, control, communications, computers, intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, and combat operations, and is said to have a critical function in transmitting tactical data within the military. Depending on the payload, the drone can remain in the air for up to 12 hours, with a data link range of more than 62 miles or 100 kilometers. The range can be further increased using satellite communications or SATCOM, which enables the drone to attain a spatial coverage of more than 30,000 square kilometers. The Luna NG can carry a payload of more than 66 pounds or 30 kilograms. However, the Luna NG's most exciting feature is its ability to carry other kamikaze drones. Special compartments on board this UAV can accommodate several small drones that can be remotely directed at targets and act as kamikaze drones. This innovative solution allows the Luna NG drone to perform multiple tasks and makes it a versatile soldier on the battlefield. Bayraktar TB2 The Bayraktar TB2 is a medium altitude and long range tactical unmanned aerial vehicle system manufactured by Baykar Makina for the Turkish Armed Forces. The UAV has a length of 21.3 feet or 6.5 meters, wingspan of 39.4 feet or 12 meters and a maximum takeoff weight of 1,433 pounds or 650 kilograms. The power plant integrates a 100 horsepower internal combustion engine driving a two-bladed variable pitch propeller. The drone has a range of more than 93 miles or 150 kilometers and can fly at a maximum altitude of 27,030 feet or 8,238 meters. It has an endurance of 27 hours. The basic type of weapon adapted to be carried by the TB-2 is the MAM-L version of the soaring guided missiles. After dropping, it's able to reach a moving target of up to 5 miles or 8 kilometers from the vector, or 8.7 miles or 14 kilometers from it after installation of an inertial navigation system linked to the GPS system. The second dedicated TB-2 gliding missile is the MAM-C, or mom Sirit, which is able to pierce a 200mm RHA steel of medium hardness. Sarisa The Sarisa unmanned combat aerial vehicle is part of the Sarisa family of versatile aerial platforms developed by Spirit Aeronautical Systems Technology, an unmanned systems manufacturer based in Greece. It is designed to offer organic close air support to military units. The Sarisa can be configured with different cargo and weapon systems to suit diverse mission requirements. When equipped with laser-guided rockets, the drone can be a cost-effective alternative to highly expensive attack helicopters. 
The drone can provide 20 minutes of continuous flight with a maximum payload of approximately 77 pounds or 35 kilograms. The flight time varies depending on the payload and the mission type. The swift reconfiguration allows the drone to function as an armed air platform equipped with various weapon systems for tactical air-to-ground attacks or as a tactical cargo carrier. When equipped with either laser-guided or unguided rockets, Sarisa can offer various operational capabilities to military units, such as defending islands against naval invasion, supporting special forces operations, and serving as an organic system on naval units. Janaya. At the International Defense Exhibition and Conference, or IDEX 2023, the Abu Dhabi Autonomous Systems Investments Company, ADASI, a member of the EDGE Group, unveiled a mock-up of its Janaya Unmanned Combat Aerial System. The Janaya project is the result of three years of research and development efforts. In a few years, it has become clear that the interest of the company in unmanned air systems and precision units has been high and recently won many export contracts. There are rumors that the company has benefited from the experience of many South African engineers after the collapse of their companies. The Janaya is designed to guarantee covert characteristics, with the possibility of working individually or in different formations to perform different tasks, such as attack, exploration, and ground support deep within enemy defenses. The company states that the UAV will have artificial intelligence for decision-making, but it does not specify whether the AI is for navigation or assault missions, or both. Wing Loon 3 Chengdu Aircraft Design and Research Institute from China unveiled its new Wing Loon 3 unmanned aerial systems during Air Show China 2022 in Zhuhai in November 2022. The design of the Wing Loon 3 is similar to the Wing Loon 2, consisting of a monoplane, slender fuselage, and empennage with a prominent V-tail and ventral fin. The landing gear consists of two main wheels under the fuselage and one single wheel under the nose. The Wing Loon 3 has now four hardpoints under each wing. It has greater payload capacity and can fly a longer distance. It can carry PL-10E air-to-air missiles, which have a firing range of 15 miles or 24 kilometers. BA-7 anti-tank missiles, AGM-300M air-to-ground missiles, glide bombs, and presumably electronic warfare systems and radio intelligence. In terms of technical features, the Wing Loon 3 has a maximum takeoff weight of 13,670 pounds or 6,200 kilograms, a payload capacity of 5,070 pounds or 2,300 kilograms, a flight range of 6,200 miles or 10,000 kilometers, and flight autonomy of 40 hours. The XQ-58A Valkyrie The Kratos XQ-58A Valkyrie is an experimental stealthy unmanned combat aerial vehicle designed and built by Kratos Defense and Security Solutions for the United States Air Force's low-cost attributable strike demonstrator program. Under the USAF Research Laboratory's low-cost attributable aircraft technology project portfolio, it was initially designated the XQ-222. The Valkyrie completed its first flight on 5 March 2019 at Yuma Proving Ground, Arizona. The Valkyrie is the first example of a new class of high-performance unmanned aircraft that can be rapidly built and used in large numbers and will work in teams with manned aircraft. The XQ-58A did not use a runway. Instead, it launched with rocket assist from a launcher transport trailer and landed using parachutes and airbags to cushion its impact with the ground. The aircraft has an internal weapons bay for small munitions tested on later flights with other XQ-58A aircraft. Bayraktar Akinci Bayraktar Akinci is a long-endurance unmanned combat aerial vehicle developed by Turkish drone manufacturer Baykar, which was formerly known as Baykar Makina. Designed to operate with different ammunition configurations, Bayraktar Akinci allows the company to upgrade its unmanned aerial vehicle technology as per future requirements. The drone is the successor of the Bayraktar TB2 tactical UAV and serves as a leading variant in its class. The high-tech unmanned aircraft has been designed to perform various operations supporting fighter jets. It is equipped with dual satellite communication systems, air-to-air -air radar, electronic support systems, collision avoidance radar, and synthetic aperture radar. The Akinci is fitted with different weapon payloads such as laser-guided smart munitions, missiles, and long-range standoff weapons.
The unmanned vehicle can achieve a cruise speed of 173 miles per hour or 278 kilometers per hour and a maximum speed of 288 miles per hour or 463 kilometers per hour with an operational range of 3,107 miles or 5,000 kilometers and an endurance of up to 20 hours. Operational altitude and maximum altitude of the drone are 30,000 feet or 9,144 meters and 40,000 feet or 12,192 meters respectively. Mojave The Mojave is a short takeoff and landing unmanned aerial system designed and developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems, a manufacturer of remotely piloted aircraft and radar systems. The Mojave has a reduced footprint and large wings that provide room for high lift devices. It can support forward basing operations as it does not require traditional paved runways. The avionics and flight control systems of Mojave are based on the systems of the MQ-9 Reaper and MQ-1C Gray Eagle ER. The drone has seven hardpoints, including six underwing points and a centerline one to carry the weapons systems. Four hardpoints on the weapon stations on the wings can carry up to 650 pounds or 294.8 kilograms each while two additional hardpoints, one on each wing, provide a capacity of 350 pounds or 158.7 kilograms each. The central hardpoint provides a payload carrying capacity of 500 pounds or 226.8 kilograms. The Mojave UAS can carry up to 16 Lockheed Martin AGM-114 Hellfire air-to-surface missiles or other missiles in a similar configuration. The Mojave provides a maximum endurance of more than 25 hours. The unmanned system has a flying range of 2,877 miles or 4,630 kilometers in a ferry configuration. Anka-3 The Anka-3 represents the latest advancement in Turkey's UAV technology and is expected to play a pivotal role in various military operations. Developed by TAI or TAI, this combat drone boasts a delta wing design, which offers exceptional aerodynamic performance and flight stability. The unmanned aerial vehicle's maiden flight lasted 1 hour and 10 minutes, reaching an altitude of 8,000 feet or 2,439 meters, and a speed of 173 miles per hour or 278 kilometers per hour. The prototype is powered by a low-bypass turbofan engine allowing it to achieve an endurance of up to 10 hours at 30,000 feet or 9,144 meters. It also has a service ceiling of 44,000 feet or 13,411 meters, with a top speed of 489 miles per hour or 787 kilometers per hour. Once it completes all of its trials, the combat drone will serve as a Turkish Armed Forces unmanned capability for suppression and destruction of enemy defenses, as well as surveillance and deep strike missions. Well, that's all, friends. Thank you for watching. Write in the comments which of the combat drones you like the most. Also, click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new interesting videos.